So I want to give you guys a quick look at uh, two of the items that I got over at the uh, Cold Steel sale today. Um, now I actually have multiples of these items uh, because of how cheap they were. I picked up a Cold Steel Time Machete. This is the second Time Machete. And a Cold Steel Copus Machete. Uh, these were pretty cheap at five bucks. Uh, these are ten. Now, seconds usually means that there's some kind of a little uh, nick or defect with it. Nothing that will actually ruin the performance of the weapon, but uh, it's not sell you know not to their quality of standard to sell as a brand new item. And again, this is one of the examples. In this case here, you can see that uh, this would be like maybe an error one. They did not finish. Uh, yeah, there's no uh, edge on there whatsoever. So they didn't put the edge on it. Um, for the most part, it honestly looks straight, you know. Uh, it has maybe a slight bend to the right. But aside from that, I mean, it honestly looks pretty good. This is the... Uh, you know, pretty long handle feels pretty sturdy now it doesn't come with a sheath either so again for uh, five bucks not a problem now the copus I have not opened uh, they were sold along with seconds so I'm assuming that there's going to be just uh, hold my foot there so that I can uh, get this open that out I mean I see the tang of the blade there um, don't usually see that in these I mean I've only had one I did send it back because it had some issues but uh, all right you know what let's just uh, go ahead and actually check the blade itself So, let's see, there's some watermark on it. Uh, maybe some very, very light rust. Nothing that I, I can't really uh, take care of, that I could, that I could just really take care of myself. Uh, the edge is ground, but not sharp on this. So, it's got the sticker there, Copus Machete. Um, point is uh, a little bit squared so no you know what it's still not a bad uh, it's pretty light I actually like how I like how light this is um, it's still not a bad find I gotta be honest not a bad find at all uh, for 10 bucks with the sheath I could easily put an edge on that um, and then just reprofile the tip so that I can have a sharp tip on there. Maybe I might not even do that. Handle feels just fine. Um, yeah, I mean, again, except for, aside from a few things here and there, I mean, it was definitely worth the money. Kind of wish I would have picked up a few more. Uh, but these were 10 bucks with the sheath. The time machetes are five bucks without the sheath. Um, and again, I picked up a few, I uh, picked up multiples. I'm not gonna mention the amount. But I do have intentions of, uh, probably with the exception of this one. This is the one that I'm actually going to keep for myself. Because I do not have a long machete at this moment. Uh, so potentially this one, I'm going to keep. I was thinking of buying the Royal Kukri machete. But uh, this has a longer blade. And I like the shape of it. And, they, and, they, and I, I like the guard. So I might just hold on to one of these. So, yeah guys, just wanted to show you what I picked up today. So again... Cold Steel Copus Machete and a Cold Steel Time Machete, all seconds. Um, again, this one doesn't have an edge, uh, but I can I can add an edge to it no problem. That one, uh, it's ground down. The edge is ground, but it's not sharp. Uh, not a problem for me either. Uh, you know, it's, uh, just no sheath with sheath. All in all, I think I got a good deal. Anyways, guys, thank you for watching. If you guys liked the video, hit the like button, subscribe, and have a great day.